the man behind the meme. Okay. Oh, wow. It's wow. Yeah. Was this like a talk show? See, didn't, wait, didn't Leroy Jenkins get kicked off of, um, wasn't like Blizzard working with him until he said the N-word? Didn't he say like the N-word on a live stream and they got mad about it? I, I think that's what, yeah, that's what it was. Something like that. I, I don't remember. It was a long time ago. Tonight, okay. the story of Leroy Jenkins. Oh. The man who got famous for prematurely ejaculating himself onto the face mm. of battle. That's good. He is Ben Schultz, a regular guy from Lafayette, Colorado. Just a normal average guy. guy. From Balloon Boy's house, as it happens. Uh huh. At the time, he was 24 years old and earning his degree in electrical engineering. Oh, I don't think you're supposed to put those in the water. So, Ben and a few of his mates got drunk one night okay. on 40s and decided to make a guild. Yeah. They settled on the most sarcastic This name. guild used to actually be on my server, Pals for Life. I think they still might be on the server. It was the actual Leroy Jenkins guild. They could think of. Pals for Life. Holy but they shit. needed more people to join so they could raid. Yeah, of course. So they made this video. Oh, jeez. So that video? Yes, it's stained. That video was a guild it. advertisement. So it goes on, they get 720 no scoped by the welts. Yeah. Here I made like a that. map so you can see what it looks like without all the chaos. Find a full version on my second channel. Wait, what the fuck? As soon as they uploaded like a breakdown it, the views for it? went bananas. Leroy oh became a star, baby. Yeah. People went crazy over this. Yep. But fame was a cruel mistress to it sure was. taking as much as she gave. Sure. People started to follow him around in the game. They See? Because it's fucking annoying. Because it's fucking annoying if they follow you around. See? It's just fucking... It was annoying then too. Camp outside UBRS, hoping he would show up. Yep. He would get hundreds of whispers every day. Yep. Some like this. Some like this. Fuck you. Like yep, this. exactly. He even had a stalker who would follow him day in and day out trying to find personal information. Yep. In those days, WoW didn't allow cross server play either. This so is what they would do, man. Cues and wait times. But I have to deal with these fucking people, dude. There are people that they will put me on their friends list and message me the moment that I log on and just be like, hey, dude. Hey, you want to do like a mythic dungeon with me? Hey, dude. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, dude. Uh, hey, dude. Uh, would you want to come to this raid that I'm doing? It's like, oh my god, man. Just like leave me alone. Like I wish that I could do it as like incognito, man. It it drives me insane. I know like some people like it's like yeah they're fans, I, but like there's there's like being a fan and like being weird, you know. I mean like I don't know. I think it it's weird. All right, it it is fucking weird. Uh, yeah, I mean, come on, no offline mode. I like, the thing is, I'm not very social, okay? Like, whenever I play games, I am, I am anti-social. Fucking full laughing skull. Yeah, there you go. And when you got in, there were even bigger problems. Yeah. Loot lag. Rollback. <laughs> disconnect, what? Which meant re-queuing. Wait, so the, ser the server for Leroy Jenkins got full just because of Leroy, just because of Leroy Jenkins? Is that for real? Like, I've never even heard of this before. What the fuck? That's insane. Oh my god, man. Leroy's video was attracting tens of thousands of new players to his server. Yeah. It was beginning to impede the way he played the game. Get richer, cry trying? That's about right. Worse? It wasn't the kind of fame that allowed him to get rich either. That's disappointing. It was meme fame. That's he and his guild tried fame. to make money by selling merch, but Wait, they had really? trouble with Blizzard's copyright. Yeah. So the best they could do was sell shirts with Ben's face on it. They didn't what? sell very well. They invited him to host at BlizzCon. All right, I was cannon rushing, just being a jackass, just drinking. It went okay. Ben was offered a job at EA. Oh my god. But he turned it down because the pay wasn't great. And it was only a six month contract that would require him to move across the country. Just fuck that, dude. Sounds like a blizzard. Yeah, it sounds just like blizzard. Uh, drinking, what a surprise. Well, yeah, I mean, drinking on the job 
Like, that's what BlizzCon is supposed to be. Like, if you go to BlizzCon, like, there's, like, a Hilton hotel that's, like, across the street from the convention center. And everybody that goes to BlizzCon spends more time getting drunk in the lobby of the Hilton hotel than actually at the convention. Like, that's actually what they all fly out there to do. Like, the convention and all that video game shit is secondary. Okay, if you ever go, you'll see it's true. Meanwhile, Blizzard sees the popularity of Leroy yeah. and pumps out figurines and lore. Jeez. Ever notice how Leroy gets whiter over time? Interesting. <laughs> they even make him into oh, a boy. quest. But yeah. it's voiced by some random guy. Yeah, that's, that's, ben that's kind of weird. Ben decides to send an email to Blizzard and say, uh, hey, hey uh, 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 what about uh, me? Yeah. So they let him VO for it. Okay. And then, that's it. He was invited to a few other events. I didn't even know anything about this. Yeah, I'd never even seen this before at all. Like, I never paid attention to, like, internet culture. <laughs> but that's about all the recognition offered him. Yeah. How's the guild doing? The guild's doing Meanwhile, actually pretty well. Meanwhile, Pals for Life had become yeah. the most attractive guild on the server. And it was turning into a veritable bukkake of yeah. success, with glistening splashes yeah. of legendary items and trophies Amazing. glazing its founders. We'll be right back. Police are on the lookout for Leroy Jenkins Jr. of Jacksonville. Oh, no. They now have a first degree murder warrant oh, out for the 43 year old. Oh, no, dude. But back to Ben Schultz. Okay. So. See, like, I never cared at all about, like, internet celebrity culture. Like, I still don't care. But, like, back whenever I was, like, younger, the only internet celebrity I even knew of was Boxy. That was it. Because she was on 4chan, and I thought she was moderately hot. Like, that was it. And, and like, I'm trying to think of, like, any other... I guess Athene... Yeah, I liked watching Athene's videos. And, like, Swifty's videos. Yeah, that was okay. And that was fucking it, man. Like, I never gave a shit about, like, this, like, internet celebrity shit that people cared about back then. They're like, oh, did you know about this guy or that guy or whatever? Like, the, yeah, I never gave a fuck. Jesse Slaughter. During Jesus an interview, Christ. he says he's working on a new viral video that will yeah. be out by the end of the year. Okay. But instead of another viral hit, the new video. he dies. What? Okay, no, he didn't die. What but he fuck? did quit the game. Oh, wow. He was bored with it. Well, that... All of his Jesus. friends were. That's... Jamal and Anthony quit in 2007. Oh, no. And Abdul in 2008. Oh, my it God. It seems that Pals for Life really meant Pals for about two years. Fuck, dude. Leroy comes back in 2011, oh but he doesn't God. stay around for long. He doesn't even play his own quest. Jeez. Fuck, dude. That is in 2011, he makes an appearance in a fake trailer called The Chronicles of Rick Roll. A the Chronicles of Rick Roll. Yeah, okay. It's just a bunch of, about a bunch of fucking internet memes. Yeah, I'm sure it does. I, I mean, like, I get people, I guess people just, like, grow up and stop playing the video game. Isn't that kind of sad to think about people that are just, like, they're just not playing the game anymore? I don't know. Yeah, it's like fucking boomer real life shit. It just sucks. The Tabard? Yeah, Tabard is good. Full version of the movie, of course, is never to be made. All right, show me. Probably a good Let's idea. Let's do this. Okay. But in that same year, he gets a proper brush with Hollywood. What the fuck is the this? The Warcraft movie oh, is announced. Oh, yeah. One of the first versions of the script here yeah. features Private Jenkins. A rogue soldier who breaks rank and charges into battle before he shoots. And then they cut it out. But before production, they cut him from the script. That's no the way she goes. They do invite him to the premiere, though. That's sad. Here he is with Jamie Lee Curtis. Yeah. Jamie, I hear you've been yelling Leroy Jenkins all day. Yeah, we're, we're playing. Yeah, I'd love to hear your best one. All right. Ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, my God. 
I got a surprise for you, though. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. All right, Jones, let's do this. Okay, dude. I feel like it would be kind of. Oh no! Just like that guy looking straight into the, the movie fucking did all camera. Right. In China, so oh, they'll great. probably make a sequel. And if they do, uh huh, it'd be nice to see Ben make a cameo. Yeah, that'd be cool. I, I guess that would like, kind of suck if, like, you get really popular or famous for, like, one, like, kind of little thing like that, and then everybody only knows you for that one little thing, and people don't really give a shit beyond that. That that would kind of, yeah, that for yeah, one Yeah, that would line, suck, dude. wouldn't it? Like, like that say the thing. That would be fucking horrible. Yeah, that I mean, imagine that. That would be fucking that. horrible. Mm -hmm. Imagine getting famous for one thing ever. Well, wow. Holy shit, that would be the worst thing ever. I can't even imagine that. Well, no, that's not true. Like, Just people asking you to say the one thing that you were popular for that one time for years and years and years, and, and that's the only reason anybody ever even knows who you are. They, yeah, that would suck, man. Fuck, dude. I that's feel so not bad true, because now it's two things. I feel things. so bad. No, you've got two things now. You've got re and what a day. What do you, what do you mean? I'm not talking about me. Oh, okay. Never mind then. All right, yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. Well, that's true. Yeah, of course. It makes sense. Yeah, w what a day, man. Ben has gone back okay. to his regular life as an electrician. How about that? And that's the story so far. The man, the meme, mm -hmm. the icon of internet yeah. history, Ben Schultz. Good night. That is kind of weird how it's like people get famous for like one little thing like that. All right, and no that's problem. It. I'll just be here doing my research. Oh, okay. What the fuck is Ooh. it? Oh yeah. no. Oh. Ooh. Oh my oh, fucking yeah. god, dude. Ooh. Jesus, that is so nasty. That's so fucking dirty, man. You should have done streams. Well, here's the thing, right? Is that um. <sighs> Like, he couldn't do streams because they didn't have streams back then. By the time it was, like, 2011 and, like, people... The thing is, like, you couldn't really... Like, look at Athene, for example. It's like you get famous for, like, one thing and then, like, that's about it. I don't know. I'd feel like that's kind of sad, you know? It's time to toast to 15 years. Everyone raise your sword. No enemy can defeat us. There's no battle we can't win. Wow. When we crunch the numbers, stand together and... That's actually really good.